The Enterprise Pipeline Operations System utilizes an administration interface. This application takes advantage of the existing Silverlight mapping container used in the operation system, but accessed in this form gives us different actions. Here I can click on a real-time data container and manage the SCADA feeds that are used to populate the information in the container. I can manage information such as the facility ID, type, or title. Each component is accessing a web service for its independent list of attributes. Once I define the real-time data container, I can begin to manage the data points. I can update, remove, or add a new data point. Supplying a caption and its associated point attributes will define how the information is presented within the real-time data container. This information is immediately updated in the Enterprise Geo database and the end users of the Enterprise Pipeline Operations see the changes as they take place. The administration interface also allows for management of the predefined views. This is sort of like a bookmark operation, only that it manages the core default views for all users of the application. As an administrator, I can define the layers and the map extent for the new view. I can further set additional transparency parameters for the base map layers as needed. Giving it a distinct name will allow users of the system to quickly find the new view. Once saved, the Views window allows me to save or delete views as well as modify the tags associated with the view itself. This solution was built using RTS Server version 10 in the Silverlight API. We are taking advantage of the feature service for direct editing into the Enterprise Geo database.